going on cave dwellers it's a beautiful sunday here and perfect 65 degree weather so we decided to front put the front z01 add-ons rock guards on bagheera because before we took it from the dealership we had them put on the, the rear ones i know you guys have seen the video of that yeah like right there z01 add-ons so great company um definitely protect your ride if you want to um of course the paint especially on the panther because we we already went over it black diamond tricoat it is an expensive paint uh, we also did get the touch-up paints as well which again thirty dollars for touch-up paint uh, it's not cheap so imagine you having to repaint a whole side or a front panel or yeah so we're gonna do this she's gonna open it and we're gonna do a video we we actually Tried to make it quicker for you guys to watch, so we already removed the clips uh, in the wheel wells of each. And th these are the deluxe ones, so they're a little bit thicker, um, but they're textured on the front side of the, of the watch, well, the back side of it. So that it kind of looks just like the paint, which is really cool. Um, but Tony can show you. Instructions. Instructions. When all else fails. Freaking. Yeah, about that. All right, so we got some stuff. What we got, Tony? We got a baggie. With? Not drugs. No. All right, so this is the clip to help to help secure the side the um, rock guards onto the inside of the wheel walls, and we'll show you exactly where that goes as well. Oh, of course, the instructions will tell you too. Boom! Right there. And these are the Deluxe Rock Guards. These are for SS 2016 and up. Um, Let's see, back front. Back front, it does ha come with 3M tape as well. Now, what we made a mistake about, well, I made a mistake. I got the ZL1 ones thinking I wanted them to be wider, but because the ZL1 is actually a couple inches wider on the front end, they didn't fit. That's why when we- still we, have them. We, do, we still have them, so mm -hmm. we don't know what we're gonna do with them yet. We if might do a cave gi giveaway, or if somebody watching wants it, we can certainly do that for you, get, get you a great price on it. Um, but they didn't fit, so if you have a ZL1, 2017 and up. Huge difference. Big difference, but babe, show them how thick the rock guards are, actually, because there's two different standards of rock guards. So these are the deluxe ones, uh, which are pretty thick, as you can see. And as uh, you can see, they're actually textured on the back side. So if you put it kind of near the paint, it's kind of nice. It'll look pretty just like it. And those are the Z01 ones. So if you want a pair of them, contact us and definitely sell them to you. Sure. Um, at a good price, of course. These aren't cheap, obviously, so we'll, we'll hook you up. Uh, but. As you can see, Bagheera is ready. And I'll just show you the back ones because we did those at the dealership before we took possession of the car. So these are the back ones. You can see they are pretty wide, but I didn't want to be throwing, you know, rocks behind other Camaros. So they're a really easy install. And we will show you exactly what it's gonna look like. Piping yeah. to put in the. How are we gonna do this? All right, guys, you are gonna need isopro alcohol. Okay, make sure that the surface of the car is super clean, clear of anything yucky and nasty because you need the 3M tape to stick to it. You're gonna need some kind of device to pull the pins out of the car. These, the little plastic T pins that you're gonna have to pull out of the car. There's going to be one on each side. We're going to show you where those are in just a second. You're going to need, obviously, the rock guard. Rock guards. You're going to need a paper towel for the alcohol. Um, I don't recommend using cloth because that's a hot mess. The little fluffy things will get all over the place. You're, you're going to need these clips. So, have everything ready. I like my little metal sticky things because everything sticks in there and doesn't get lost. 
Okay, so we're gonna wipe down the inside of the car because we have already stuck our little thing in there and pulled our pins. So here is the pin that came from the hole on this model car right here. Okay. <clears throat> going to wipe down the car, make sure that there's no oily, greasy, rocky, nasty, anything. Can't say the Camaro Cave doesn't do DIY, DIY, baby. Yeah, that whole car behind me was DIY. <laughs> yes. Yes, it was. I got scars, all kinds of... You want to pull two inches of the 3M tape. 3M tapes and heat the you know thingy off the, the back of your adhesive. Yeah. And um, that way you have a tail on the outside because once this gets in there, you're gonna need a tail to rip the rest of it loose. This has to go along the edge of the car right here. You're gonna to want to make sure that this hole, not this one, this one, lines up with the hole that we just pulled that T-clip out of. And keep track of your tail, because if you don't have your tail on this side, you screwed. You screwed. Get in there. Fantastic. There you go. Okay, so you're going to line your little red 3M tapey thing up with the edge of the car, get down to the point where your bottom part that's loose sticks to the car. Okay, we're stuck. Tonya the professional. On um, the Panther 2024 Camaro SS. Now remember guys, this is for all 6th generation SS's 2016 and up for these rock guards. Alright guys, so what you were seeing was Tonya about to put the rock guards, the L1 add-ons rock guards on the car, but we may, ran into a couple issues. Isn't that right? We did? Yeah, they didn't fit. Oh, we did. We did. What do you mean we did? <laughs> so you, this, this next part, you're going to see her actually cutting the rock guards. I am? You are. I am. She is. I am. Yeah, that. But stay tuned. In just a couple seconds, you'll see her rocking the Dremel tool to cut out the rock card so it fits on Bagheera, and then we'll show you the finished product. Take two. Take two. Tonya's over here working, slaving away on these ZL1 add-ons rock guards so they can fit our panther here. And we actually already got the driver's side done. We had a four on the car. Yeah, three out of four on the car. We'll have to do a little customization. A little. <laughs> Just a tad. <laughs> With the drill. Drummel, sorry, drummel tool for everyone watching. But yeah, it looks really, really good now. So we got the side rocker for protection and the ZL1 add-ons. Rock guards for protection. The rear ones have been on since day one, but but since we were getting the side rockers on the car, we had to try to customize the Zeon front rock guards. And these are the deluxe ones. They do not fit. They do not fit without some customization, just because of the rock guard, of course. Now, I'm gonna be protected. 
Right, Tonya? Oh, yeah. She's working away, dude. It was pouring here, so we figured we should go work on the car. Oh, and we just added a couple pieces under the hood. Right there. Just little side pieces for protection and to, to hide all this stuff underneath. Which is, they changed it for, well, 2020, 2020 when they redid the, redid the headlights. So, these needed a little custom fit as well. But we detailed underneath the whole engine bay today as well. It's all ready for the next show. So, we got these from... Fast Tech Performance, Rotofab, Coolant Cover, Heartbeat of America Cap, and we actually have a couple more things coming, but, but we will uh, tell you tell you about those when they arrive.